All right, Shalom. All right, first and foremost, I want to give all praises to the Heavenly Father and His only begotten Son, Yahweh Bahashem, Yahweh Shai Bahashem, Rukar Kadash. Double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone, and a peace, love, and salutation to you, Akim out there that's pushing his truth. And truth and sincerity, I'm the brother I know from the GMS Atlanta Church. And Lord willing, this lesson's edifying. So, um, <clears throat> this is a response to the brother GMS Watchman. Uh, this video, Dumb and Dumber, man. If you haven't seen it, I'm going to just start off by playing this video. Alright. Yeah, man, we out here. H-O-I Walmart, son. Ain't no HR Walmart. Because <laughs> it be shut down. What well, we out here at Well, you know the Shabbat is actually, the Shabbat opens so we good. Kind, man. Even the FEMA can't go be, son. They don't know about that, son. They don't know about that, son. We really ain't supposed to be in here, man. It's Walmart, you know? Sure, wait. <laughs> yeah, man. Sure, wait. <laughs> <laughs> Look at my head. No him. My name is Ice. No him, Ice. Don't leave me, don't leave me. Don't leave me. My name is John. I have water. John baptized. Don't leave me, don't leave me, don't leave me. God name is Yahweh. He's a little shy. Yahweh shy. Don't leave me, oh, don't leave me, please wait. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Listen, listen. This is Eve. I put her in my pocket. Eve out of pocket. Oh, don't leave me, oh, don't leave me, don't leave me. Oh, we're in Babylon. Look at that tower. Tower of Babel. Oh, well, don't leave me, oh, don't leave me. <laughs> yeah, man. Oh, praise to you. Oh, by shit, oh, shine up. You know, we got to stay quarantined. Stay with the mask on. You know, watch for Esau coughing and sneezing. With that Moab over there picking his nose. See, this is what I'm talking about, man. Moab over there picking his nose. This is what I'm talking about. Uh, social distancing. You got to social distance yourself. Uh, that's how you stay away from these players. Uh, get this mask and get them latex gloves. Because uh, you don't know where people's hands been. You don't know a damn thing about where these people been. Uh, so stay quarantined. Stay with your mask on. And come your shot ox. Be safe. And stay quarantined. What the fuck is wrong with you guys out there, man? All praises to Yahweh about Shem Yahweh Shai about Shem. And that's the video from the brother uh, Israelite Covenant. <clears throat> but um, hey, man, the scriptures prophesy this, man. This is uh Second Timothy three, and uh, I'm gonna start at verse uh thirteen. But evil men and seducers shall wax worse and worse, deceiving and being deceived. So you're gonna have men that's gonna do. A great manner of folly like that you know taking the lord's name and making a joke out of it you know uh, if i find it funny that you know they're talking about this is where the fema camp is going to be at but you don't preach at the market of beasts is the rfid chip all right so these these people these, these jakes they say the israelites are getting worse and worse so you, you i mean it it, 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 get, it irks your spirit but you know this is what was prophesied all right Verse 14, but continue thou in the things which thou has learned and has been assured of, knowing of whom thou has learned them. So just keep doing what you're doing. The brothers that's learning, you know, the brothers coming to the fold, just keep doing, keep learning, all right? You know, to the point where you, you're going to be a teacher. This is this is not acceptable, man, all right? And I'm going to just jump up to uh, <clears throat> verse 12, man. It says, Yea, all that will live godly in Yahweh Shai Hamashiach shall suffer persecution. We come into that time where persecution is going to be on the rise. All right, Esau just looks at videos like that, and that's just further adding fuel to the fire, man. All right, just making a mockery of the Lord and just making you putting yourself out there in these situations. This is uh, 1 Corinthians 14 and 26. <clears throat> How is it then, brethren? When you come together, every one of you have a song, have a doctrine, have a tongue, have a revelation, have an interpretation. Let all things be done unto edify. See, so like I said, you know, this would be a perfect time if you're talking about, you know, Walmart, 
you need to you need to bring out the truth. But to see, this is what happens when you don't have the whole truth. You don't have the hundred percent doctrine, man. All right, you gotta remix the doctrine and, and do uh, silly, uh, fun and games and whatnot, man. That's not edifying. All right, you, you laughing about FEMA camps? This is a this is deadly serious, man. All right, you're gonna be offered with that RFID chip in these in these FEMA camps. That's what the, this guy or this particular camp is failing failing to tell you, man. That that's not edifying at all. And, it, and there's a lot of young men that's coming into this thing. You know, no matter if you're in in your in your in your uh, late teens, your twenties, thirties, forties, you know, Israel gets the wrong impression when you put stuff like that up. That's that that's not done into edifying, man. You know, they think that's cool. When I mean, you're just supposed to teach the word, man. So this is um, it's <clears throat> another scripture. Um, was it uh Proverbs fifteen and twenty one? That's yeah. This, this definitely goes into these guys. Proverbs 15 and 21. Folly is joy to him that is destitute of wisdom, but a man of understanding walk up uprightly. All right? That's folly, man. That is nothing to edify. You're supposed to wake up the lost sheep of the house of Israel, not make bloopers in the middle of the street. And it seems like this is from Atlanta. And, you know, considering the fact that there's all beyond these protests with this guy Rayshard Brooks getting shot. All right, there was another Jake, uh, you know, that got uh, apprehended by the police in Atlanta. You know, why are you in the middle? Of, why are you down there in the middle of the street at night? All right, no, and, and knowing the danger that um, that's in these cities with these protests. This is uh, Proverbs four and fourteen. Enter not into the path of the wicked, and go not in the way of evil men. You should know when when to. Uh, Go into situations and when not to, and that's what these other camps don't teach you. They don't teach you how to be circumspect in these days. That that that's an example of not being circumspect. You go here cracking jokes in the middle of the night, and when all hell could break loose, man. All right, especially when the persecution comes, man. You guys out there with fringe t-shirts, some something pop off and you get blamed for it, and then here goes the persecution, man. Cause cause of some idiots out here, man. You know. Verse 15, avoid it, pass not by it, turn from it, and pass away. All right, got another scripture. Uh, Sirach 32 and 11. It says, <clears throat> rise up be times and be not the last, but get thee home without delay. You got to know when to uh, take your behind home, so to speak, man. And this is not an example for Israel, especially to the times that we're coming into. Because you got a lot of these guys... That are at these protests and these rallies, that's not wise at all. All right, you got to know. You got the, the scriptures say that the Lord called us to be soldiers in this thing. Matter of fact, I'm gonna get it. All right, you got to know when to go home, man. All right, you got to know when to take yourself home, man. Especially in these evil times, man. Before that, let me get this right quick. This is a uh, Amos, um, Amos chapter five, uh, verse thirteen. Therefore, the prudent shall keep silence in that day, for it is an evil time. All right. We're in some very serious evil times, bad times. All right. Anything can pop off today. OK, we're at to a point where they're going to shut this thing down again because of these inflated coronavirus numbers, man. But you got Israelites who are not out here edifying, not teaching, not warning you against the vaccine and the mark of the beast which is the RFID chip. This is what you get with these other camps. All right? And then when the, uh, when the correction comes, all oh, you guys are hating. No, we're trying to look out for you to tell you that danger is coming and to prepare yourself and not be caught up in the folly, man. All right? So, um, let me see. Oh, yeah, that, that scripture in Timothy right quick. All right, this is... Uh, give me one sec. My Bible's a little old. All right, um, I think it's Second Timothy. Yeah, Second Timothy chapter two, verse three. Thou therefore endure hardness as a good soldier of Yahweh Shai Hamashiach. No man that warf entangleth himself with the affairs of this life, that he may please him who have chosen him to be a soldier. So you gotta be a soldier in this thing, man. All right, you gotta be know when to move in, move out, certain situations, when to leave certain situations. You got to think strategically in these last days, man. You even got to make a move when you go into the grocery store, man. You know, especially in these times. 
Something as simple as going to the grocery store. You got to strategically learn how to do that. But what are the other Israelite camps telling you how to do? Be out there while that, late at night cracking jokes, thinking, taking the, nor taking the Lord's name in vain. All right? So, uh, yeah, that's basically it, man. You know, um, I, I think I have one more. Um, yeah, I'm going to go to Ephesians 6, man. Just end it off on that. You know, this thing going to be too long, man. But, you know, for brothers that's watching these videos, man, just stay circumspect out there, man. There's a lot of these camps, man. They're trying to get, just how, like, they're trying to, um, just how, like, these Black Lives Matter protests are trying to get you caught up into the flock, the, uh, the slaughter. These other camps are, too, man, with this folly going around, man. I still don't see why other Israelite camps are still doing rap videos about the pandemic Instead of going out to the highways and byways and coming from the scriptures, the Jeremiah 28s and 8s and, you know, what Yahushua talked about in Matthew 24 and telling these people what's coming instead of giving them folly, man. All right. All right, Ephesians chapter 6, verse 10. Finally, my brethren, be strong in the Lord and in the power of his might. Put on the whole armor of the Most High that you may be able to stand against the wiles of the devil. And Satan is out there like a roaring lion, man. Like he mentions in 1 Peter 5 and 8. Satan is working uh, uh, hella overtime right now, man. So, you know, this is an example of what not to do, you know, for us, you know, coming. Um, that's in his faith, man. Because, you know, one false move, man, and you just caught out there, man. You know, you got to, you know, think. Um, matter of fact, man, I'm going to just go. I'm going to land back, man. Um I know I'm everywhere, man, but, you know, we come to some times, man, you just got to be extra circumspect, and that goes for me first and foremost. You know, that's what's that one scripture I wanted to get. Uh, just bear with me for a sec. Um, damn, it was, in, it, was on, it was in my head. Okay, uh, Ecclesiastes. All right. <clears throat> Ecclesiastes uh, 3. Ecclesiastes 3 and uh, 1. To everything there is a season and a time to every purpose under the heaven. A time to be born and a time to die. A time to plant, a time to pluck up that which is planted. A time to kill and a time to heal. A time to break down and a time to build up. When is the time that this place being broken down, man? So, you know, expect more, you know, folly from these other camps, man. Um, expect more sorrows, all right. But you know, us that's in the know how, you know, we just gotta hide ourselves spiritually, man, because it's a it's an evil time, man. You know, getting out of the way of uh, judgment out here, man. But that you know, just avoid being a uh, you know these dumb and dumber guys, man. You know. So, hey, Lord willing, I was edifying. To the next time, I'll say shalom. On.